Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. Our next guest is a triple threat. She's an actress, dancer, and producer, and so much more. Oh, absolutely. Please welcome the beautiful Emmy-nominated actress, Shanti Lowry. Yeah. Woo! Yeah. All right, now. How are you, Shanti? I'm so good. Good. Nice to see you. Oh, you amazing. Oh, thank you. I love that dress. Oh, boy, I love thank the color you. of it. Yes. So nice. Nice so and nice. warm. Well, let's just get right into it. Hot Girl Summer. We, I, you know, if you watch the show, then you know that we are always stalking. Mm -hmm. uh, we like to stalk the Instagram because you don't know that we're stalking. So uh, it, it works for us, right? Privately stalking. Yes. Yeah. So to me, you're having quite the Hot Girl Ooh. Summer. Like, uh, tell oh, us about it. Thank you. You know, that's funny. Yeah, I guess so. Um, I've just, I like to live oh, wow. life. Oh, I, yeah. um, I have a, as an actor, you have to have a social media presence. Yes. It's not something you can yes. avoid. And so I try and be a force for good mm -hmm. in that as much as I can. And I just try and post positivity. Yeah. And, uh, Was that yoga? Yeah, it's mm -hmm. kind of yoga. I'm, I'm a dancer uh, by, originally. Yeah. And so stretching is really important. Mm, yeah. I love to work out, but it's really important to stretch Looking as well. Look there Get we go. Girl. Hey, hey. hey. Yes. Hey, so, yeah. how does a girl from Boulder, Boulder, Colorado, get to Hollywood? I should write a book. You probably that, should. That is, and give them all the easy. steps in yes. terms of how to do that. Actually, truly, because yeah. it wasn't easy. Yeah. Was, how'd you do it? It started with a dream and uh, a really positive role model in my mom saying, mm. "You can do it. Wow. You know, it's going to be hard, and you're going to have to work." But you can do it, yeah. and I, I think that's really the biggest um, thing that I had going for me was somebody believing in me because mm -hmm. it's not it's not easy. There are a lot of no's. Yeah. Looking the way that we do in an industry that that uh, is just now starting to open mm -hmm. its doors a little mm -hmm. more, mm -hmm. um, it just it creates more. It, it's a harder path mm -hmm. to get there. Mm -hmm. So you just have to believe in yourself. At what moment did you know that you wanted to be become an actor versus a, a, a dancer? You know. I don't know that there was ever a moment that I decided that. I just want to tell stories that affect people. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I don't think there's a difference whether you're singing or dancing right. or speaking. Yeah. yeah you're yeah. you're talking. You're you're communicating. Oh, look at that! So, Ooh, wow, just, girl. Ooh, girl. Love it. I, and I, you know, I, I've been dancing since I was two, and mm -hmm. I think we've been acting. We've all been acting since we were born too. You yeah. know, that's just something <laughs> you're, you you kind of know how to do. So I love that I'm finally being able to put them all together and tell stories with everything that I yeah, have. Yeah, yeah. Well, you've been fortunate enough to to star in a lot of our favorite shows and yeah. movies. So right. which, which one would you consider maybe your breakout role? I think most people recognize me from a little show called The Game. Yeah, yeah. 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 awesome show, I know. I, I was honored, look at this, mm -hmm. Tia. I was so yes. honored Great to show. be a part of this show. Um, and it was a really big stepping stone for me because it was such a good show. It was yeah, quality. It, it, really, it really, it was yes, really good. It really show. Was. Yeah. 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 So uh, Hollywood is uh, your backdrop and everything that you're doing now. How, what do you? How do you feel about more roles being created for African American people in Hollywood? I think it's wonderful. I think it's important that it's not just um, roles being created for people who look like us, mm -hmm. but different stories being told mm -hmm. because. You know, what, what you look like on the outside is truly just, is, it's a shell. But we all have these very different stories um, based on where you live, based on how you grow up, your experiences. And when you only have um, white writers or, or, or writers with similar experiences, mm -hmm. then those are the stories that are told. Mm -hmm. So I was very fortunate to be, you mentioned the Emmy nomination. I was nominated for a show called Bronx SIU, mm -hmm. and we have brown writers and black writers mm -hmm. and, and so much melanin behind yeah, the camera yeah. and in front. And it, it means that the stories that are being told are a little different, too. So your character, you're playing a detective, yeah. uh, Yolanda mm -hmm. Rodriguez. Yolo. Uh, well, yeah, exactly, <laughs> exactly. So what can we expect from her this season? You know, I actually don't know. I haven't seen anything really? for what? season three. There's two seasons out there. You guys have to check it out. Yolo's gone through a lot. She's a very layered character. and. Uh, She's got anger issues. She's got addiction issues. Mm -hmm. um, so there's That's a lot, a lot to, of issues. Th a lot of issues. There's a lot to tackle. Yeah. A lot yeah. to handle. Yeah, I'm gonna have to call your agent because you have a new show <laughs> called <laughs> Stuck <laughs> Together. <laughs> you know, in addition to everything else yeah. you're doing, you have another show called Stuck Together. So tell us a little bit more about that in your role. Okay, you now this one you don't call your agent. This one I created on my own. Oh, I, well, I need to call you. Yes, yeah, call uh -huh. me. Call me. Um, <laughs> 
That's so right. yeah, you know, the Emmy nomination opened doors. You know, yes. this is what it does. It's it's a it's a pat on the back, but more than that, it's a chance to do more and mm -hmm. tell more stories and go further. And uh, through that, I, I said, it's time. I'm going to create my dance show. Mm -hmm. It's a fun sitcom that you can just sit down with your family and watch and enjoy. Um, Lighthearted, except there's also going to be a beautifully shot, high concept dance scene in every episode. Oh, wow. And uh, it's, it's always going to be a different style. And this is scripted, right? It is scripted. It, it comes across like reality, almost. Yes. Or so like a competition show. That's that what was it comes actually the as. audition. Oh. That was, uh, you know, we had like 500 dancers come to LA who really want to be a part of this project. Yeah. And that's what you were just Look seeing. at you. Oh, come on, Mulder. Yes. Yes. Come yeah. on, man. Come on, Mulder. Yes. I love it. I mean, it. I sneak and I watch Dallas Cowboys, the competition. Oh. I love that show. Yes. Uh, okay. I've <laughs> seen it once, too, and yes. it's pretty great. But pretty you know, great. much continued success with everything mm -hmm. that you Thank touch. You. I really hope that you Absolutely. prosper. And guess what, everybody? To find out more about her and her upcoming ventures, follow her on Instagram at Shanti Lowry.